Hello and welcome for the gamers. My name is Borek and this is another episode of Green Hell, the awesome survival game where we play in the jungle as a Tarzan with parasites, fever, fe fever and stuff like that. Oh, there's a bone knife. Let's drink that one. Yeah, so as you can see my stats are going down really really fast and thing is that I got myself a l infected leg. So that really really sucks. I will pass out soon since I don't have any energy whatsoever because of the fever probably. And let's hope that I won't die during the, doing that. And I will get some strength back. So in today's episode, yeah, I actually cut myself on purpose to check if I can heal myself. So we will do it together. Fortunately, I am uh, still alive. So let's see how it's gonna go. Uh, I think those maggots will help. Okay, so I think that one stopped. And the thing is that I have absolutely no idea what to do next because I think I can use the ash campfire, campfire ash and uh, bandage to make the ash dressing to speed up the healing process of that wound. I don't know if I should know. I think I need to wait a bit for that one. Let's try not to die. I have some food that I can use and some drinks as well. Uh, that's gonna be really really close call so I have absolutely no idea how it's gonna go. I have some mushrooms that do not cure parasites but as you can see yeah I have found I think I have found a salvation. It is oh shit it is still dark. Well it's actually 5 in the morning so it should be all bright soon. Right, I also, I also have this meat, charcoal, no, I don't want charcoal, I don't want bone yet, I want to heal myself, so let's harvest that, and I have some, I have some uh, rattlesnake meat that I would like to cook, uh, you know what, let's actually make a campfire really, really quickly, right over here, somewhere, uh, to cook, yeah, that's good place as any, mm, nope. I'm not interested in that. So let's put some sticks. Don't tell me that I don't have any more sticks. God damn it. Harvest that one. Am I still alive? Yes, I am. So <laughs> it's all good. I'm not going to be sleeping just yet. I don't want to... Oh, now I won't have enough. Energy to start a fire. But that's okay. Let's check how my wound is doing. Because there is another... Oh, no. Let's check how my wound is doing. It's all good now. So I've cured myself, which is just perfect. Let me just apply the dressing before I pass out. <laughs> Let's hope that the, that this wound won't get infected again. Because if that will be the case, then I'm pretty much dead. Because I don't have any more maggots. But it seems that no time is passing when you pass out. Which is good. Okay. I've lost that, that 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 dressing. Did I drop it? No, I think I've just lost it somehow. Uh, no matter. Probably that's a bug of some sort. Really, really doesn't matter. Okay, so let's cure the leg. Let's cure it. Am I okay? Yes, it looks like I am okay. I have absolutely no idea what to do with the fe fever. Uh, but we will work with that later on. Right, let's take this. Now, I have a fever, so let's check what is possible cure. Leech, fever, fever, yeah, there it is, not, not vomiting. Fever is naturally thought of uh, body over time, making infusion, infusion of plants, okay. Increases dehydration temporarily, reduce sanity. That's okay. Now, the good news is that I finally, finally found the cure for the parasite disease that I have over here. This is not the mushroom that I was looking for. Oh, there's a bird's nest that I could take. So let's take it. Let's take it. No, not that one. This one. And I found a log somewhere over there. There's still magnifying glass over there saying me something. And probably I should do something about that. Right now I'm on the edge. Holy mother of leeches. God damn it. 
Where did those guys came from? Oh, I know. Jungle. Okay, that look that leg looks quite alright. So it was somewhere over here. Yes, those guys. Not these, but those guys. Orange mushrooms. Yes, orange mushrooms. They do not glow in the darkness. Holy shit. But look at that. Now I have only two parasites. So that's great. Probably I will have to be staying like over here for a longer period of time. Um, fighting the feeder, fever and trying to st stay alive over here. Quite unfortunately, I don't have enough energy to start a fire, which is a bad thing, but I might actually find some more, find more mushrooms over here, and since there's quite a lot of coconuts, it really doesn't matter for me if I move along or just try and stay here. Try to survive right over here. Maybe I will find some more wooden logs with those mushrooms. I have no idea how long it takes for them to, respo uh, to respawn. But I will be... I will keep passing out probably. Oh yes! Here is my cure for the parasite. It's all good. So this encampment in my opinion is really really good. Because if you catch any campfire, campfires, parasites, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, it's really uh oh time, you know. Don't I don't I have any snacks over here whatsoever? <gasps> any snacks would do. Oh shit, let's drink, let's eat, let's harvest, let's try, okay, to stay alive. Coconut flesh, coconut flesh, and now let's start a campfire. Let's use this one because I have a little bit, a little bit of energy and maybe I can make some infusion, some bone infusion. No idea. What? I think that didn't work. Not enough energy. Come on, baby. Ah, shit. Okay, I know, I know, I know. How am I doing? Not so great. Okay, I have much more water in my python. So let's drink it. Let's drink this one. Let's harvest that one. I know I will pass out again. Holy shit, it's like, you know, absolutely and awesome and fantastic. Absolutely awesome and fantastic party that I have keep having constantly like over and over. I'm doing like holy shit. That's empty. Expand if I harvest it. What will I get? Probably spoil. Oh yeah, yeah. Once again, but my health is going up. I'm not losing sanity, which is good. I have no parasites whatsoever except for the fever. But you know, fever is not hardest thing right now. Really, really quickly start the campfire. Put the bird's nest in there because I want to make myself some infusions. Okay, ignite, use the rattlesnake meat that I have, cook it really fast. Now, get some water, fresh water from that Biden. Great, 59. I can actually pick up one of those. Although I should have plenty, like shitloads, okay, no worries. As soon as those will be done, I'm going to be cooking myself some infusions. Look at that, I'm getting my sanity back as well. I think I could actually go to sleep to get some rest, like a proper rest. Holy shit, <laughs> look at that. I can drink for days. Yeah, so this location is, I must admit, it is really cool, especially that there is a... Um, there's also there's also a um, fish trap so let's put that one over here I can put a bone cook it make an infusion again whoops again pass out there is no loss when you pass out so actually you don't have to worry about 
anything. At least I don't know anything about that. And that infusion I can drink and it will give me some proteins, fats, hydration and some energy as well. And look at that, I've lost a fever. Which is just great. I have absolutely no idea what that watch says. What does it tell me? But look at that, I'm all good. I'm all good. And on the plus side, I have loads of stuff over here. So, on that note, we will be building Obsidian Nile because one of you guys told me that I should make it, I could make it with Obsidian Stone and I think that, oh. Maybe not. Maybe with just a stick. That's Obsidian Axe. Small stick? No, okay, so let's make Obsidian Axe because why not? Why not improve ourselves and except for the fact that that one is like dark. I don't know if there's any difference if uh, it has much greater stone spear. If it has a uh, greater greater durability or what. Okay, let's watch. Let's see the watch. I need some proteins for sure. That's okay. I'm really happy that I came back here. Because of the well, mainly because of the fact that peacock. Thank you. Oh no 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 no. Why I don't have any space? Probably because of all those coconuts and other type of bird feather like th that. I have nine. Okay, peacock bars. Let's harvest it. Did I got some meat? Yes, I did. Did and I also got some hooks that I actually uh, uh, fish bones that I actually don't want. They should throw away for now. Where's that meat? It's over here. Rattlesnake. Let's eat it. Let's get those stats back to normal. Yes, I am almost there. I am almost there with it. Do I have any more bones? Yes, I have another one. So let's cook a bone. Let's make a stock of some sort. Ah, life is good. Life is good. So I was really, really struggling. I was really struggling over there with those parasites. But now life is pretty much perfect. Look at that. And not to mention that I can make... I can gather some other stuff. Make other types of infusion. But I have no need for that. Okay, let's just jump into bed. Let's regain some stamina. Comfortable sleeping. Yeah, perfect. Look at that. Okay, my sanity still needs some... Oh, shit. That one is burnt. Not good. I didn't want to do that. But let's eat it. Oh, I lost some sanity, but I got some proteins back. Which is perfect. Now all I need to do is eat some mushrooms to get those hydrocarbons. Not to mention the amount of co uh, coconuts that are over here. Which is just perfect. Look at that. One, two, three. And each will give you five. So I have uh, six, seven in total. That's like 35. Okay, good. Also, I got some energy. Nice! I don't have too much fat, but that's okay. On that note, I think we're going to be going back, uh, or trying to go back to the place where I have found, and try to make a living over there. Let me just save the game, since I'm all cute! Look at that! And I think it it, it should be like day 12 already. Nice. Okay, so let me just try and go back to the place where we were and maybe we'll start building something. Or maybe I could just go over here. You know what? Let's find another thing. I have like two palms over here. So let's test first. Let's test axes. One, two, three. I'm not cutting those, am I? Let's find another test subject. I need like two test subjects that I can...
cut down with axes to see if there's any difference between stone axe and obsidian axe. Okay, so stone axe, banana. One, two, three, four. And obsidian. One, two, three. Pretty much the same. So I don't think there's any difference between those two. If you do know exactly if there is any difference, please let me know. Please let me know in the comment section down below. That would be wonderful. Righty then. So I'm going back or trying to get back to the place where I used to be. And I try to make a living over there. Although I should get some bamboo sticks. But then for the filter I still won't be able to build one. Won't I? And that would be perfect to have it over there. Like water filter, long stick, bamboo log. Bamboo water filter, long bam bamboo log. Some stones. Okay. Okay, on that note, I believe I should go back to the bamboo forest. Try to cut down big as. What's that? Wood resin? Ouch! Oh, shit. Beehive. Yeah, 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 I know. Ooh. Ah! Honeycomb? Nice! Ah! That wasn't so nice. Okay, so let me just check if I can take bamboo log like into my backpack. Bamboo log. Yeah. I will have to carry it. All the rush. Okay, you know what? I'll try to carry, carry it to the place where I think I might be living in. I don't know if that's going to be a possible thing to do. If not, then no worries. Okay, so stay tuned. I will be just right back. Righty then. So I'm back at my lovely waterfall paradise over here. And I slept overnight. And quite unfortunately, I caught a worm right over here. So this shelter is not good for sleeping. I don't know why. So, since I brought those... Uh, logs I think I should build myself a water filter right over here so what do I start with some log sticks long sticks will not be able to will not be hard to make and quite fortunately I have some bananas over here I have some meat that I can catch as well to get some food going and also I have this awesome honeycomb probably it is good for the fever it won't spoil, so I'm not going to be doing anything with that just yet. I need to get some myself some long sticks, so let me just do some cutting, and then I'll get back to you as soon as I'm done with all those things. I think it said free. It actually needs two, so no worries. Although, it looks like, no, actually two, not three. Okay, so that's done. Now some stones. I should have some big stones over here that I could harvest. Although, there were some small stones, I think, over here as well. Small comfort, there's one. There's a bigger stone that I can harvest to get more stones. But, although I could use those stones, you know, to... Dry leaf. Let's take it. I could use those big stones to make a proper campfire. Now I caught something again. God damn it! What the hell is wrong with me? This, par uh, this paradise is not so paradise as I think it is. Holy shit. Every time I get those leeches, there's more of them. Oh, come on. Come on. That's more like it. That's more like it. So let's start with, with that. Bamboo lug. Let's pick one up, boom, and some rope, and it's done! Look at that! Fun-freaking-tastic! And now I can hunt down some 
fishes as well. There are some natives coming over here, which does make me a bit uncomfortable. There is a big stone, no worries. So I will make my campfire like big campfire. Let's stand still for a second and then they will relax. Haha! -ha! Great. Harvest it, get more get more fish bones for more for more um worms I guess. But it's all coming together, I must admit, since I've get rid of those parasites. I'm quite happy. What's that? A long stick, I will keep that for later on. So yeah, things are coming together, I must admit. Okay, so that's that. Quite unfortunately, there are no coconuts over here. At least I don't see any. Which would be a great source of um, coconut fingers, like bowls, but that's okay. I have a little bit of shelter over here. Nice place that I can call my home. Some charcoal. I wonder if I can make this big round thingy-jig over here, stone ring. Yes, I can. That's nice. Put a small fire. Maybe if I build a ring. No idea. Okay, I will put some stones over here in between videos. There's one. There are some small. There are small stones over here. Let's actually hope that this will work. If not, then I'm gonna be salty, salty as hell, because I will have to destroy my drying rack. But that's okay. Okay then. So things start to look more positive now, which makes me very, very happy. I have some fish down there. I can build a fish trap or continue building the fish trap because I've already started that. So yeah, it's going to be all nice and positive from on, from now on, I think. Uh, uh, I'm getting the, getting to know the surroundings as well. Where can I get to place A and place B? So that's all good. So yeah, that's going to be it for today's episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to leave a like, comment over the gameplay, subscribe to the channel if you're new and you like what you see. And I hope that we'll see each other in the next episode, where we'll continue our awesome adventure here in Green Hell. So tell them to get easy. <laughs> what? Have fun. And happy gaming. Bye-bye. More fish bones, shit.